welcome to this guided meditation for the month of May. So today at the time of this video is May Day, the 1st of May, and also known as Beltane in Celtic traditions. And it's a festival that's halfway between spring equinox and the summer solstice in the Northern Hemisphere. And this ancient festival was a celebration to mark the start of the summer and one of the most important um, pagan festivals because, well, as you can see, if, if you're in the UK like me, you can see things are growing, leaves are coming out on the trees as flowers and it's getting warmer a bit anyway and sunnier. And we're feeling the abundance of nature and celebrating that. And also, you know, there was celebrations of love and, you know, you see all the animals mating and everybody's sort of like happy, feeling better that the days are longer and it's lighter and getting warmer. So let's um, meditate together and Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you love my videos, I'd appreciate it if you can support my work by buying me a cup of tea. So, turn off any distractions. If you want, grab a journal. If you want to do some journaling afterwards about anything that came up, I always kind of mark these sessions um, changes at the beginning of the month good time to let go of stuff and step into like we're stepping into like to moving towards summer a new month and whatever's happened in the past is now behind you so when you're ready take some deep breaths and close your eyes. So as the sound of the bell dies away. Let's use this opportunity now to tune into that positive energy of spring and summer, lighter, longer days. And notice how that feels in the body. Feel your spirits being lifted. Maybe you feel lighter, as if you have more energy, enthusiasm and motivation. Feel that life force moving around you. And you can imagine yourself like a blossoming tree. You don't even need to do anything. Allow it to happen naturally. As you sit and focus on positive energy. Not ignoring anything that's troubling you, acknowledging it. But choosing to shift your focus onto possibilities and what feels possible for you right now.
when you can feel it, like the branches of a tree spreading out and the flowers opening on the end of the branches and the leaves coming out bright green, new, fresh. You don't even need to think about all the old ones. Just focusing on what's emerging. What's emerging for you right now in this moment? Where do you want to place your energy and focus? And keep your attention on the breath and the body as well so you don't end up getting caught up in thinking, analysing and just sitting, observing what's possible for you right now in this moment. And every time you get distracted, just come back to the present, ground yourself, feel the support of the earth. You can imagine that there's roots going down on the soles of your feet, going down, supporting you, and also you're connected to the divine through the crown chakra. And as that opens, you can imagine the branches extending out like a tree. And just as people love looking at trees and blossom, you have that positive energy, that beauty within you too. And just like trees, if we allow it to radiate, you don't even need to do anything apart from be your true authentic self. Let go of any shame, any anxiety or worries about what other people might think of you. And as we move towards the summer, this is your time to grow and blossom and show your beauty and talents to the world. Remembering that you're divine, you're not separate. And we can let go now of any beliefs <clears throat> that keep us separate and disconnected from the rest of nature and the rest of the universe, knowing that we're all one. Feel any barriers and misconceptions just dropping away 
melting down into the earth as you continue to bloom and blossom. And with each breath, a new flower, a new petal is opening. A new leaf. A new branch. As you grow, expand and take up more space, the space that is rightfully yours. And now just imagine you're that tree, standing tall, standing strong, rooted, grounded, as well as showing your true, full beauty and magnificence. Now you might just want to start to make some small movements. Rolling the shoulders. Wiggling fingers and toes. Take some deep breaths. Feel the space that your body takes up. You feel moved, have a stretch, really take up that space, own it. It's always a good exercise to do, stretching as wide as you can. You're amazing and I love you. Now my invitation to you is to go outside and connect with the earth barefoot if possible. Um, I'm going to go for a walk on the beach. <laughs> so and really sort of ground yourself in that energy that you've created in this meditation. And if you want, you can journal on anything that came up or do, just do some free writing and see what comes up. Because myself, it's always interesting what comes up in these meditations because it's, I channel it all and it's like, and I know that the messages I receive are just the messages for us all, for myself included. 
And so, um, that, yeah, that reminder that take up space, to be that tree, and just be beautiful and shine. That's all we need to do. So until next time, take care, go well, and lots of love. <laughs>